Okay, we have a few things on the agenda. Mostly deep cleaning the crap out of this place from top to bottom. Just a major, major deep cleaning. Honestly, had it had been on my schedule to do this already. We have company coming into town on Friday. Guess who's coming? Mimi and Pop. Mimi and Pop are coming to see you. Are you excited? But not yet, on Friday, a couple more days, okay? And then they'll be here and they'll snuggle you and they'll let you sleep with them. Yes, they will. Yes, they will, because they love you. My in-laws are coming on Friday, like for a quick weekend. They were in California for a conference, so they're just gonna come down and see us for a couple days. So I wanted to make sure the house was ready for company, staying the night and stuff. So I have like a whole list of deep cleaning things that I want to do. Also, we found, I found, I found a flea on Rue this morning. So that's also freaked me out a little bit, but it's perfect timing because I'm literally washing everything, deep cleaning everything. And I spent the next like hour, hour and a half brushing him with like the fine toothbrush that we have, like going through all of his hair, knocking on wood that it was just the one. And I saw like a couple spots where it obviously bit him that were irritating him. So I'm just like really happy I, I saw that one. He's been itching for a little while now and he doesn't really do that, he never really scratches. And so I was just like, what the heck is going on? So I'm glad, oh, I'm so glad I found it. But I think it's the only one. We are gonna do a very intense bath tonight to kill off anything left, so. I really do think he's good because of how like thorough I went over him and any time today if he was like sniffing, scratching, licking, I was like running over and like looking at whatever it is that he was scratching just to make sure and it was always just like the little spots where the bites were so I'm feeling actually fine. I think it was a one-off. We've literally, he's literally never had one before so we've never ever had an issue. So this was his first and I like it. like felt so bad all morning for him especially like when he had been itching and i was like cut it out like stop and now i just feel bad because he couldn't help it obviously we're gonna do all the precautions and stuff but needless to say the house is about to be turned upside down i've already washed the sheets even the new big comforter that's all in the in the dryer and i'm also gonna wash our rug out there since it's washable it's always fun to watch cleaning videos so here we are. I want to get the car done too. So maybe Christian and I will take it either tonight or tomorrow to give it a good vacuum and scrub down. Yeah, I just want a very a clean, clean space. Honestly, I want it for myself. <laughs> so it's just a really happy excuse for me to have a reason to deep clean. I was like having some really bad anxiety this afternoon, which is just kind of came out of nowhere. But at the same time, I'm also like still on my period and that happens to me often if I'm on my period and I'll just get like these random spurts of anxiety so I kind of had to take take a minute I literally washed my face I did my ice roller I sat down and did my devotions listened to a few minutes of the bible and had Rue cuddling with me did a few like breathing exercises and definitely feeling better so I could still feel like my heart rate's a little bit high, but I'm feeling better. And I think getting around and moving and cleaning will just help. Oh, it will just help too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He's been so loving lately. Oh. I've been loving today. You know mama needs you today. Mm -hmm. We love you. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Okay, what do we even start with? I have all this tax stuff out here, which honestly, maybe this is why I was having anxiety <laughs> because taxes, but this is the first year we have a tax man helping us do our taxes because a lot of things this year with Christian starting an LLC for his dental stuff, just like a, a lot of layers and one of the offices is 1099. So we just have a more complicated year this year. So we just wanted to make sure, especially with the LLC, that everything was done correctly. <laughs> and this, all of our recycling from like the last couple days. Honestly, I would wait until Christian got home, but 
when I'm in my cleaning modes, I just want to get it all done. We'll see how far I get. I'm gonna put some music on and let's get rolling. <laughs> Yeah, that we did a lot already, don't you think? Just those few things, but those were big, big ticket items, if you will. Now that that's done though, oh, thank you for the hug, thank you. Now that the fridge is stunning, I'm gonna add a few things that I got for my in-laws, some of their favorite drinks. They love unsweet tea this brand and then they like the grapefruit sparkling water so i'm gonna go ahead and add these to the fridge so they're cold and ready for them okay perfect nothing like a clean fridge you know what i mean a fully stocked this is like my favorite is when all of the best drinks are stocked I love that. Progress. This is day two of my deep clean. Got actually like a lot done yesterday, so that was good. And today, feeling better, <laughs> feeling better. Yesterday, I just was like not feeling myself. So I'm happy to have gotten a good night's sleep, blasted my worship music this morning, dropped off Christian, we got some starbs. I'm gonna take Rue down for a little walk. I just did a bunch of work and then I'm gonna run the few errands that I need to run today not much i think i just really want to get some fresh flowers oh gas costco gas so just a few little things and then i'm gonna get back to my deep clean list the rug is done it's dry i just need to put it out which i might wait for christian because it'll be probably easier with him so we'll see we did do the bed yesterday
a wet angel. On the way to lunch, heading to Carlsbad to meet his parents. They're driving down from, where were they, Irvine, right? Um, no, uh, Anaheim. Anaheim, the conference was in Anaheim. So, anyways, we're meeting in Carlsbad. Unfortunately, gosh, yeah. it's raining again. Again. Oh, and look how beautiful over there, too, with the ocean. It's just like so yucky, unfortunately. I feel bad. Thankfully, they've been here to San Diego quite a bit, so they've experienced what it normally is like. <laughs> but we're gonna grab some lunch. I think maybe take them to our, one of our wine bars that's down in Carlsbad. So I think we might take them there. And then on the way back to our house, the flower fields are here. Do you guys remember, did I? We vlogged that, right? Yeah, yeah. it was Christian's birthday last year when, the, when we went to the flower fields. Big flower guy. Yeah. <laughs> And I mean, it's one of the most beautiful things. I don't know that we'll pay to like walk in, especially if it's rainy, but you can drive on the back side. I'll show you if we're able to do it and see all the flowers from like a parking lot in the back. Okay. We'll probably, I'm not really sure if I'll vlog the whole weekend. It's hard to vlog when you have company and stuff, but we always do fun things when we have people in town. So I'll we're try to, I'll try to bring you guys. To yeah, I know. I'll try to remember to at least pull the camera out. It's okay. Sunday afternoon. We just had lunch and dropped off my in-laws at the airport. So now we have the rest of the day to just do weekend things. And the sun is out. Finally, finally it's broken through. It was overcast all weekend. So we're gonna go on a walk. Go outside, I think go down to the water. Maybe grab a coffee at Super Bloom and walk around the bay right there with this one, of course. So It'll be fun, and then I'm not sure what we'll get into this afternoon, but it'll be San Diego kind of day. So, let's go enjoy the sunshine, get some of this vitamin D back into our systems. <laughs> you know? I can see the way you're sitting quietly You look a little lonely With your heart out of your chest I'm screaming help Forget all about today My brain is filled with mercury But it doesn't even matter We have a little cold 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 so nice. It was really nice. It was so nice to oh, just be in the sun. Yeah, yeah. We, all, we had like 8,000 steps or something like that. So, yeah, it was yeah. beautiful. Mm -hmm. But that was fun. And then we're just going to hang out at the house for a little bit. And then, oh, time change happened last night. So the yeah. sun is not setting until 7 o'clock tonight. So nice. Like, Finally. Oh, I'm so happy. And then we're going to go down to Bird Rock and meet some friends for some drinks and appetizers. Uh, 
Paradisia, which we've taken you guys to, but they're doing, in for daylight savings, like they're doing cocktails since the sun is setting late. So it's gonna be cute, we'll bring you guys. Ah, it was a good Sunday. Yeah, really good Sunday. Yeah. I know, dropped my parents off. Yeah. Felt so bad for them, because basically, right, you, you know, I mean, the sun came out at the, like basically right as they were leaving, essentially, so. But it is what it is, they've been here before and they, Know they what it's like. know, yeah, experience it. It's normal. not like their first time in San Diego. A so. normal San Diego experience, but. Come on, I said good boy. It's a tired, tired day. Oh my right, goodness. Go he literally it. got out of the car and laid down in the parking garage. <laughs> Change of plans. Yeah. Paradiso is like fully booked. But we definitely thought it included more than just the bar area. Yeah, it was just like a little bar. It's like tiny. It's literally like, probably only fit, what do you think, 10 people? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tiny, so. so our friends got there and they're like, uh, there's no room. So, but that's okay. We're down in Liberty Station, which is our church is literally right back there. And then our wine club, Carruth, is right across the street. Yeah. <laughs> so we've taken you guys here like quite a few times, but they're gonna head over here. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 